For the drive, we will bring up the Driver Performance Assistant or DPA by using the menu control switch. This is now monitoring our driving performance. It's looking at driving style, primarily anticipation and braking efficiency. Up ahead we have a roundabout, so I'm going to throttle off and allow the vehicle to decelerate naturally before activating the exhaust brake. Remember, we want to try and keep the truck moving as it's better for us and it's better for the truck. Engaging the exhaust brake now and I'm looking for my gap and to achieve a little more performance from the exhaust brake, downshift manually or feather the brake pedal which also allows the AS Tronic to downshift given a more powerful retardation. Exiting the roundabout and going back onto the throttle will override the exhaust brake and you can see that we've got good results for both anticipation and efficient braking. And with a straight steering wheel, simply switch off the exhaust brake. If you don't switch off the exhaust brake, then every time you throttle off or cancel cruise control, the exhaust brake will engage. This may be detrimental to anticipating the conditions ahead and so affect your DPA score.